Well, this is a huge game tonight. Uh, our freshmen uh, play really well on this team, and so does uh, the upperclassmen too. We're lacking upperclassmen, so the young girls get thrown in the fire this year. And uh, each game, they seem to build on it and become better team teammates and uh, better basketball players altogether. Sometimes in a consolation game, you get, you know, maybe maybe not as important of a game to some people. But out there tonight, you guys and Nishnabana, you guys were going full board. This is an important game for you. Oh, exactly. And I think uh, Nishnabana had the same uh, idea as we did. This was our championship. Uh, the two two teams that played for the championship tonight were the two best teams in the conference. And we, uh, as much as I would have loved to play the late game, uh, the, this game was our game. And we had to go play um, play within our ability. And we played a team that matched up very well with us. And uh, we just went out and did the best we could. Macy, I think, had six and a half, finished with 21. Was, did you kind of tell her to be a little more aggressive in the second half? Oh, not necessarily. Uh, the first half, first half of the season, or first part of the season, uh, there's times that she didn't engage enough, and then there was other times that she was uh, trying to do too much. Um, I've told her, uh, instead of telling her what to do all the time, I just if she's having issues, she feels like maybe her shot's not on, she needs to wait and let the game come to her. And that's what she's done. She's grown up a lot of the last few games. She kicks a lot. She makes people collapse on her and then kicks out. And uh, the other girls are coming around and making the baskets they need to make. Obviously, this is a really fun week in corner conference tournaments, and uh, able to get third makes it even more fun. Talk about the going, you know, getting back down to earth, playing regular season games next week. What's going on? Who are you playing? Ah, oh, man, I gotta think now. Um, I know we have East Mills next week. Um, we have uh, kind of blank right now. I'm sorry, but um, yeah, we need it. We need to get back to our basics. I know that uh, in the stand game we didn't box out really well. We boxed out a little better this game, uh, not to where I needed it to be. But with a game every night and uh, our boys playing, you know, we just don't seem to have the time to do the practicing we need to. So it's back to the, the gridiron, you know, next week. Coach, thanks a lot. Good job tonight. Thank you. Um, I think we started off really well. I mean, we pushed the ball up the court and um, really got the open shot a lot. And um, ball movement was great tonight by everyone, and everyone could shoot. I mean, Emily Smith could hit the three, and Kaylin had a good, good, good shots. And I think all in all, it was a good team game. Good you guys shoot a lot of three-pointers, uh, don't always go in. Yeah. I mean, is, that, is that kind of the game plan, though, shoot a lot of threes and just get out there and, and get them up? Yeah, I'm, we're, we're really good at shooting the three, but sometimes uh, it's good to drive. But uh, yeah, we got a three. We got a three shot pretty good in our team. Can you talk a little bit about what this means for a team that starts three freshmen, plays a lot of young girls off the bench as well, to get this third place in the corner conference? Um, a lot of people they look at a third place and they don't see a lot, but um, for us it's just the beginning, and we're really striving to get that big goal, just like our football boys. I mean, we're looking at the big picture, so this is just the beginning. All right, Macy, great job. Thanks a lot. Thank you.